So hello, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be talking about Veloview tiles. What are they? What is the Veloview website? And uh, how do you go about collecting Veloview tiles? So I'm going out to Western Zoyland because I identified uh, two little tiles that I can collect today, not too far from home. And we'll see if we can close those down just by cycling around the village. So onwards to Western Zoyland. It is very windy today, but one thing is positive sensations are good my legs feel good I feel good been smashing it a bit even into the headwind and we have got a tailwind home so all good Right, it's about to stop because the wind is just so bad that you're not going to hear me as I'm going along. So let's start with what is Veloviewer. So Veloviewer is a website that runs in conjunction with Strava and is a bit of an add-on. So you connect to the website um, by connecting through Strava and it drags all your data in. Uh, there is a fee if you want uh, a lot more data because you do get a little bit for free. Now I'm getting eaten by a fly. And it brings in all the official 100 climbs, so it ranks you on the official 100 climbs with all the other people on Veloviewer, and it also ranks you on every single climb and the time you've done and um, how many you've done, and it puts you into a rank. So if you've done all 100 and you've done the fastest, then you'll be top of the leaderboard. So it is quite quite interesting just seeing how you compare on like, the likes of Cheddar Gorge and, and Crocom and all those. But the feature I like and Dean likes is the Veloviewer tiles, which basically is Explorer tiles. And it turns your heat map, uh, for those of you who've got heat map on Strava, it turns those into a grid. So every time you complete a tile on the grid, you get a different colour for it. So the more times you do it, the, the darker the colour goes, I think. So the more tiles you collect from the more distance you go, then obviously you move higher up the leaderboard. and. Dean was the one collecting them and when I've actually uh, uploaded you can see I'm actually ahead of Dean so I'm quite chuffed to bits about that because I do like to cycle new roads. So what I'm actually doing today is I'm going to Western Zoyland because I've noticed there are two on the map which are these two here and I'm going to see if I can close those down and show you how it works. To access the tiles, go to Activities, select that. When it uploads, you'll need to go over to the right hand side and click on the globe, and that will bring up the map. And there you'll see your heat map. And if you click on the second icon down, which is the grid, click on the grid, and there you go, you'll find all your Veloviewer tiles. And you'll be able to zoom in and have a look, see if you've got any that you can search for that you need to complete and see what you've done. All right, so I've reached Western Zoyland and this is the road. I've just got to go th through the village and it should tick off two tiles, so quite straightforward. And obviously, uh, according to the route map, it just loops round and back to the main road. So it shouldn't be too difficult to find my way out of it. And so as easy as that, we're back on the main road with a tailwind where we're going. Two tiles ticked off. And the other great thing about Veloviewer is with the heat map, you can actually see all the places you've been. And, and I like the fact that you can see my 
circle across France by coast to coast that I did back in 2014 and you can see where I've all cycled in the Alps and Mallorca and it all shows up on the heat map which is brilliant because uh, that, that distinctive line across France does really look really good back from when I did that, uh, that charity ride for prostate cancer uh, we did it in uh, six days and I'm still quite proud of that fact it's going to be a long lasting memory and uh, I forgot the pain of actually doing it so I might feel like wanting to do that again at, at some point There we go, there's a little bit of an overview of Velaviewer in the Velaviewer Explorer tiles and I hope you get involved. You know, let me know how many tiles you've got, see if you're beating me. Uh, my goal is to get 5,000 tiles for the year, so I'm quite close. And on Sunday now we're going to Milton Abbas and uh, take on the, one of the official climbers, Woodland Hill. And that should be good. There's currently only three of us on the ride, so if you haven't put your name down yet, <laughs> there's three spaces left. Uh, but other than that, we'll see you Sunday for what is an epic adventure. So, thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, comment and subscribe. And we will see you again very, very soon.